So it is time to plug the USB-C hub. The USB-C hub has three USB 3. All the USB port has been filled and I also have an SD card inside the USB hub. Since I have a lot of devices connected to the USB hub, the iPhone is taking a little bit of time to recognize all these devices. In the end, all these devices has been recognized and they are registered inside the file application. So my next step is going to plug the HDMI cable inside the USB-C hub and also inside this portable monitor. We will see if the iPhone 15 Pro is going to display on that portable monitor. Since this is a portable monitor, it needs a power cable in order to use the HDMI functionality. I have plugged everything and it should be working right now. So basically this is my setup for the Samsung DeX. It is going to work as it is and it is going to be my DeX setup for the Samsung DeX and any other Samsung device or Android device. I just saw a new notification coming from the dynamic island and as you can see we have a displayed iphone 15 pro in this portable monitor when the monitor just came in i just saw that the image quality was only 480p this monitor is designed to display a maximum output of 1080p hd you can see on the screen it says 480p at 60 hertz so the next thing that i'm going to do is to unplug the usb-c and connect directly the portable monitor to this iphone 15 pro in this configuration, the portable monitor has a resolution of 1680 by 1050. Currently, the image quality coming from the monitor is really good and this is the one that you want. Since the iPhone 15 Pro and any other iPhone with USB-C are so new, these USB-C hubs are not optimized to support these devices yet. And also, there is no possibility inside the iPhone to change the resolution that is going to the monitor. Using the USB-C hub is not bad, but it can be improved. Currently the iPhone 15 Pro is plugged by USB-C, a single USB-C and it is powering this portable monitor and I'm playing Street Fighter and using the PlayStation 4 controller. So if you want to do the same thing, I advise that you get a MagSafe charger to charge the device at the same time as you're using a big monitor in order to have a big display to play all your favorite games. So this is going to be my favorite gaming setup with this iPhone 15 Pro. I have the big monitor, I have the controller, I just need to play now. Let me know in the comment box what device you're going to use with the USB-C on your new iPhone.